Hey guys, guess what time it is? It's time for another Dollar Tree haul. Whee! <laughs> Anyways, I, uh, this time I went to the Dollar Tree in Buena Park on La Palma Avenue, in case you guys were wondering. Um, and I went on the 12th. So two days before Valentine's Day. And if you see me wearing the same thing as my Valentine's video, it's because I filmed these two videos on the same day. So let's get started. So I found these cosmetic wedges, wedges, cosmetic wedges there, and they are for makeup, of course, and they're by the Sassy and Chic brand. It says there are 28 in here, and you know it's just for what you guys think it is. This is by the Dollar Tree brand, so it's like from for foundation, powder, blah blah blah. Um, and I already tried one of these out, and they're actually thinner than other cosmetic wedges but I thought that was fine because then I can fit it in my compact um, of my face powder and then snap it close. Um, I also found these really cool band-aids and they have uh, little action hero guys on there, Marvel comic guys. Um, and they have Hulk, Spider-Man, Wolverine and it says there's four different designs and there are 20 ba uh, band-aids in here. So let me show you guys what they look like real quick. Just so you can get an idea. So there's five of each character. So there's Iron Man, Spider-Man, and Hulk. And then there's all a whole sheet of Spider-Man there. And a whole sheet of Wolverine. And the last one is the Hulk. So that's pretty cool. Um, and I picked these up because I've been like, my hands have been really dry lately and they've been kind of like, you know, the little skins that you guys get or that you get on your um, cuticles, like they've been snagging, so that's not fun, so I needed some band-aids. And the next thing I picked up were another pack of these heel grippers. This is actually a repurchase for me, and I use these on shoes that just, um... Sometimes they slip off of my feet or whatever it is, and these just help. So you just stick them inside your shoe, um, you know, so they're that shape, whatever. They have adhesive on them already, but I guess you could, like, stitch them on for extra, you know, staying power. I don't know. Anyways, they're made in the USA, and two come in here. So I got those. They also help with blisters, too. Um, and I got this... Oh, I forgot about this. I got this allergy relief for my boyfriend. Um, and it says, it says compared to the active ingredient in Zyrtec, in that corner right there. So I got this for him actually because he suffers from allergies. His eyes get really watery and he starts like sneezing and coughing a lot. I feel bad for him. So I picked this up for him even though he always tells me, I don't need medicine, blah, blah, blah. Yes, you do. Okay, so there's that. Oh, and this is so awesome. When I came across this, I had to pick it up. They had like a bunch of them. And it's this Neutrogena Naturals Acne Cream Cleanser. It does have uh, salicylic acid. Um, and it's cool because it, this is their line that has like no harsh chemicals, sulfates, parabens, petrochemicals, dyes, or flalates. How do you say that word? I don't know. But anyways, these are on sale there because they expire in two months, so they expire in April. Um, but I'm going to try to use this up as much as I can. So there's the back of it in case you're curious. And it's just really creamy, it's white, and it smells pretty good. It smells pretty clean, kind of flowery a little bit. And then I picked up some of these dental picks. There are a hundred in here. They're by the brand Dentec, and they are the fresh mint, I guess, flavor. And that's what they look like. So they're kind of like toothpicks, but healthier than to toothpicks because toothpicks can um, splinter off, and then the little pieces get stuck in your gums, and you know that's all bad. So there's these. I got these for my boyfriend actually and then it shows you like a little diagram of how you're supposed to use them because he's always needing toothpicks. And then I got this tape dispenser because I needed one because I actually had a silver one and I had it um, like I let my boyfriend have it or borrow it or whatever it was at his house 
And I think he accidentally threw away that little piece in the middle that holds the tape because he's like, oh, I don't know what happened to it. So I was like, eh, just throw it away and I'll buy another one. So I'm going to keep this one here because I tend to use a lot of tape. But anyways, let me open it up and show you guys how it looks. So it comes in a plastic baggie. And it's pretty big. I would say it's at least like 6 inches long. And it's pretty heavy too. It has like sand on the bottom or something. And then it just comes with that little um, tear off piece of metal there. Um, and here's the little thing in the inside to hold the tape. See, that's what I was missing on the other guy. But anyways, there it is. And then you just refill it with tape. And this is actually by the Dollar Tree brand too. So there's that. And then all the rest of the items are just makeup and I'm going to try to quickly show them to you guys before I run out of daylight. So let me turn on my lights. So I was browsing through the makeup section and they had this mascara from LA Colors. I never have seen mascara from LA Colors. At least not at the Dollar Tree. I don't know about other stores. But I picked it up because I was like, eh, well, might as well try and see how it is. Um, this is in the color Berry Black and it just says Bold Plumps Lashes, new mascara for long, what? Oh, oh, it's in French, bleh. This is Lash Defining Brush, and I like the packaging, it's pretty cute how it's like a little pink bottle with a black lid, um, and it just says to apply one or two coats as desired, blah blah blah, you know, just regular stuff, and this lasts for six months after you open it, so there's that little symbol there and it's made in Canada distributed is it? no it's made in China sorry so I picked up that and I'm gonna see how that works and then they had a whole actually they had two pegs full of this elf um, what is this eyeshadow um, and it comes in the color 2020 rocker and it says brightening crease resisting and long wearing formula so that's what it looks like. Um, the colors are a bit brighter than what it's coming off on camera. I'm sorry I'm losing uh, my daylight. But it's kind of just like a sparkly white color here. And then kind of a... I don't even know what color you would call that. Kind of like a coppery pinkish color but really subtle. So that's that one. And then that one's like a purplish color. And the top one is like a sparkly black. And then it comes with this applicator there. And it says it lasts 12 months after opening. It says it's a safe journal formula. It's made in China, designed in the USA. It says long lasting, easy blending color, instantly brightens and defines. Eyes look fresh and wide awake. So, I mean, I have like brownish eyes, so I tend to go for like purple colors. And I know I'm going to use the heck out of these like neutral colors here. Um, because if you don't know already, purples bring out the uh, like the honey colors in brown eyes or so I've heard so anyways the last item I got from Dollar Tree is another cosmetics item and it's Physicians Formula and I was really excited to find this there because usually I, like I told you guys before I have a hard time finding Physicians Formula here at my Dollar Trees so this is just the virtual face powder. It says it is in the color 3527 highlighter. So it says right there. And then it says it's a multi-reflective face powder. And it self-adjusts to brighten up dull complexions for a healthy looking glow. And it's hypoallergenic and fragrance free. So that's pretty cool. And if you guys want uh, me to read the back, then stay tuned. If not, then... Um, I'll show you guys the swatch and then you can click out of the video. So it seems like it's another like really generic compact. Like it doesn't have any labels on it or anything. But I don't want to jinx myself. So let's see what it looks like. Man, these suckers are hard to get open. So yeah, I was right. It's just a really generic compact. I don't know if they like cheaped out on their packaging. I don't know. It's kind of domey too. You see that? And... That's what it looks like. And again, my lighting is 
running out on me, but I'll give you guys a little swatchy swatch. And those little bubbles are raised up. You see that? I don't know if you guys are going to be able to tell. But anyways, I think this would be a good highlighter for me. I mean, I have a really light... Ooh, it's pretty because it's kind of like iridescent when you shine it at the right angle. You know what I mean? So that's what it looks like on my finger. And then, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see that, but... No, you're not. But anyways, that's what it looks like. It has kind of like an iridescent shimmer to it. Kind of like um, coppery with like some really subtle pink undertones. So there's that. I'm pretty happy with this. And if you guys don't know how to use highlighter already, um, just Google it. I saw a little... Um, I would show you on my phone, but I'm filming on my phone. But there was like a little picture, like a diagram, and it shows you where to use the highlighter. So like... From what I remember, it was like on the bridge of your nose and like here and like under your eyes or something. So that's where it was. But anyways, let me read you the back of this packaging. It says, Virtually perfect multi-reflective pigments have chameleon-like properties which diffuse light to help optically minimize the appearance of fine lines and imperfections. Highlighter's rich concentration of multi-reflective pigments brightens up Complexion with a subtle sheen of color for a healthy looking glow. And then it says maximum comfort. Made with the finest Italian talc for a soft and ultra smooth finish without irritating sensitive skin. Compact contains a mirror and powder brush for ultimate convenience. Which it does not come with a brush. Like the other one didn't come with a brush either. Um, it says hypoallergenic, oil free, fragrance free, non comedogenic, dermatologist approved. And then for the directions, it just says apply with enclosed powder brush. Uh, may be worn alone or over makeup to brighten complexion for a healthy glow. For best results on dry, use on dry to very dry skin. Apply moisturizer prior to using powder. So there are the instructions if you guys want to freeze frame it. So that's everything for my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.